Hello everybody, Arctic here, and we've got a fun little unboxing. See, the other day in my update video, someone in the comment section suggested that I go to GameStop and I buy an Assassin's Creed Hidden Blade. Well, we did it. I'm planning on getting more. I'm planning on getting a lot more, because I love Assassin's Creed. It's one of my favorite game franchises, so we're going to have some fun with this. Um, the blade for this one goes with, grab him from back here, it goes with Aguilar. From the movie. This is the movie blade. I was gonna get the syndicate blade that had the gun on the back first, but um, I was I have to order that one off Amazon because they didn't have it in store. So so here we go. We've got that nice hidden blade. Look at that. It's got spring loaded action, everything. All right, so let's get into this. Get rid of the box. Oh, it's got these type of wires. Why does it have to have these type of wires? But there we go. Look at that. That looks that looks really nice. It's a nice detail. It feels really good. It feel I mean, it feels like a mixture between rubber and some other and some side of type of fabric. So let's get this off and take a look. All right. So it comes with a nice little blade lock and blade release thing back here, which explains back here how you can, once you push this in, how it's controlled. So you can lock it in and then I'm sure how it gets released. Oh! We'll have to figure that out in a minute. There we go. There's a nice... There we go. There's a nice look at it. And let's go ahead and pop that blade. Oh yeah. That looks great. And it's got some string to tie it on there with. So you all know what's next. We're going to take and we're going to string it to our arm using the stuff so we can test it out. Now, it doesn't look like it works nearly as easily as the um, game would show. In fact, it's the movie one. I guess that's okay. All right, so I did a minor mistake threading this. I can fix that later. It still works. So there we are. There's the nice gauntlet. And so that, that works really great. It, it, and then, of course, you can just lock it in. So if you don't want it to eject, it won't. It just sits perfectly, perfectly snug on the arm. And it has a string to adjust the, the tension. You get it like nice and centered. Mine's not nice and centered. Now it's nice and centered. There we go. Nice and centered. So, when unlock it and wah. Oh yeah, that's beautiful. So as I said, I'm, I messed up with the stringing of it. I'll fix that when I take it off, but the nice circuitry, well not circuitry, the nice gizmos. There's a blade just barely sticking out at the wrist. Oh, it looks so beautiful. All right, so back here we have the switch. The switch when it's in this position locks it. See how the blade doesn't do anything, you don't hear anything. As soon as you pop it over this way and you hit this button, the blade just ejects. So you don't have to worry about anything else popping it. You just have to remember to push the button when you want it to come out. So it's nice, it's good, there's the blade. Just pops right on out and then just ejects back in. Just a nice good, nice good material, nice good detail, nice good work. I just need to peel off these stickers so that they're not on there anymore because I feel like that just kind of, that makes it look bad. That'd be cool. So that's it for the Assassin's Creed from the movie, Blade. 
Um, nice and nice and works really well. The very good spring. Everything about this is really, really nice. Really good material. I really like it. It's a good prop. Nice and solid. The only thing that's not really solid is the blade, which is really flimsy plastic. But I, I, I've heard that there have been people who've changed them out for actual metal. So that you can actually use them. But, let's slide this back off. But there you go, the Assassin's Creed Gauntlet. This is the um, this is the first one of the ones we'll be doing. We plan on down the road getting others so that we can test out more of them, show off more of them, sh and have some fun with these. But um, I don't know which one for sure is going to be next. I also have a couple other things like the cane and all of that. But if you have any suggestions for one for specific props that you want to see, um, feel free to put them down in the comment section down below. If you'd like this video, hit that like button. If you're new here, hit subscribe. As always, you guys have fun. I'll see you later. I've got a cool new toy. I, I, I love it. Thank you guys. Y'all have fun. See you later.